With the fifth pick of the 2015 CFL Draft, the BC Lions select Esse Morabere Ajufo, defensive lineman, Wilfrid Laurier University, Saskatchewan, you are now on the clock. Well, an S.A. Mrabore Ajufo from my hometown of Mississauga, Ontario, defensive lineman from Wilfrid Laurier, one of the most athletic defensive linemen in this class. Now, the knock on him has been that he's not necessarily the most instinctive player and probably a guy who's not going to play as a true, true nose tackle, but possibly as an end, possibly a, as a tackle spot and maybe play early in his career just in passing situations where you just let him rush the passer and don't rely a whole lot on those instincts until he gets a little more comfortable. Here's a look at his combine numbers. The one that stands out, the three-cone drill, which just shows a level of agility. That was the top result for any defensive lineman uh, at the combine. He's a, he's a big kid and, and still has a lot of room to grow as well. And there's uh, He's going to be in a position to give the Lions some depth at a need where they've really committed now to start in Canadian, Mike. Yeah, when you take a look at it, you know, the great Brent Johnson was great for us. Ricky Foley came through the system. And now Westy's going to move to the weak side five. So if you could find two, why not? And certainly when you look at the tape, you've got to be impressive with the ability he had to run the rim, if you will, take the edge. He had power and long arms. You want length at the arms to do those type of things. Very, very athletic guy. And, you know, I, I know the people there really well. You know, you're about size and speed and athleticism, and this young man has it. And certainly when you take a look at it, uh, it's a good fit for that defensive line to make sure Coach Washington never has to change it up, but always lined up when he needs. Yeah, Here's a question, though, guys. He's the 17th-ranked player on the board. Daryl Watt is still there. Is this a reach? No, well, it depends what you want. Like Mike said, this kid tested through the roof. When you watch this kid on film, he can rush the passer. He has to get better at the defending the run game. But even on the zone read, he's athletic enough to close it and still make the tackle be an outside guy. So this kid will, he could at least maybe be a take over for a DI spot, play 10 to 12 reps as a defensive end, and then freeze up a DI somewhere else. Well, and this is a guy as well that's going to be able to play special teams with, with his that's athletic absolutely. ability, whereas Daryl Wad, Wad's more of a true nose tackle. Here you're talking about a more explosive athlete, a guy that can play specials, and as Mike said, you're looking at that Westerman playing that weak side five technique on the defensive line. That's not necessarily Daryl Wad's spot. Mraburi Ajufo is more of a fit for what the BC Lions do.